Multiplication. The word multiply means to increase. If you multiply something, it usually gives you more. Multiplication in math means to add the same number over and over again. If you add the following, 3 plus 3 equals 6. You just multiply the number 3 two times. Multiplying is a faster way to add the same numbers. You could write 3 plus 3 like this. 2 times 3 equals 6. Here is another example. 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 equals 8. Or you could say 4 times 2, which also equals 8. In the first example, 3 was added to itself two times. In the second example, 2 was added to itself four times. You can add a number to itself over and over and over again. When you do this in math, it is called multiplication. Here are some special words and symbols related to multiplication. This is the symbol that tells you to multiply a number with another number. The symbol tells you to multiply. Times. This is the word used when you see the symbol. Here is how you will read it. 4 times 3. Factors. The numbers that you multiply together are called factors. In the problem, 2 times 5, the factors are 2 and 5. Product. The product is an answer for a multiplication problem. 6 is the product for 2 times 3 because 2 times 3 equals 6. Here are some multiplication rules. Any number that is multiplied by 0 is equal to 0. So, 0 times 5 equals 0. Any number that is multiplied by 1 is equal to the same number. For example, 1 times 3 equals 3. When two numbers are multiplied together, the answer or product is the same regardless of the order of the factors. For example, 2 times 3 equals 3 times 2. Both are equal to 6. This is called the commutative property. When three or more numbers are multiplied together, the answer or product is the same regardless of the grouping of the factors. 2 times the grouping of 3 times 4 is equal to the grouping of 2 times 3 times 4. Both are equal to 24. This is called the associative property. The most important thing to do for learning multiplication is to study the multiplication table, or sometimes it is called a times table. The following shows you a multiplication table and how to use it. Notice where the 4 in the left column meets the 6 in the top column. This tells you that 4 times 6 is equal to 24. Here are more examples. 1 times 3 equals 3. The product of 2 times 8 is 16. The product of 3 times 5 is 15. The product of 5 times 2 is 10. What is the product of 12 times 10? If you said 120, you're right. Remember, any number times 0 equals 0. For example, 3 times 0 equals 0. This is another way multiplication problems can be written. The product of 3 times 7 is 21. The product of 8 times 5 is 40. As you learn how to multiply, you will discover many patterns, shortcuts, and tricks to help you learn how to multiply. Can you think of a time when multiplying numbers will be better than adding numbers over and over again?